we today have concluded an agreement to end the war and bring peace with honor in Vietnam. We have adopted a plan for the complete withdrawal of all U.S. combat ground forces. We are finally bringing American men home. American troops were gone, and as a result, the House of Cards began to collapse. We were dealing with an ambassador who was just convinced that somehow there wouldn't have to be an evacuation, and therefore there wouldn't have to be a concern about evacuating South Vietnamese. These people were dead men walking. Sometimes there's an issue not of legal and illegal, but right or wrong. I borrowed a truck, and I drove them to the airbase. I had told them, when you hear three thumps, that means hold the baby's mouths, don't breathe, don't talk, don't make any noise. I was going to get them out. The final battle of Saigon has begun. That morning, there must have been at least 10,000 people ringing the embassy. There was a sea of people wanting to get out. They looked up at the helicopters leaving, and I could see their eyes. That's good eyes. There are no words to describe what a ship looks like. It holds 200, and it's got 2,000 on it. We have no more helicopters. That's it. As it took off, I could see the group right where we had left them. It was just so serious and deep. A betrayal. Who goes? And who gets left behind?